up my fast builders so you can see the cubbies have won a game so no headphones today uh, again and uh, this one's special they swept the athletics not only that they destroyed them as well in fact for the whole series they did so uh, let's just get into this game that won them their fourth straight and first sweep of the season. Here we go. It is big league debut season and it is Mason Miller season. This young man has got a complete package and it is filled with horsepower, folks. We got a 100 mile an hour fastball, a changeup north of 90 miles an hour, believe it or not. Great slider cutter. But this young man is ready to burst on the scene. The family's in the house. Mom, Kristen, Dad, Matt, fiance, Jordan Porterfield. They're here. They're psyched. And here we go. Horner in there. Line drive, and that's base hit into left field. Nico Horner pumping his fist as he goes racing past the dugout. Here's Dansby Swanson. Here's the 2-1 pitch, and that swung on it. Popped up right side on the infield. Second baseman Jordan Diaz drifting that the wind has it and he drifts into short right field and he makes the catch. So Mason Miller records his first out in the big leagues. It's a pop up by Dansby Swanson and here's Ian Happ. Ian Happ is three for nine in the series. He lines one to second. That's a double play. So a line out double play. Miller will take it. Cubs do not score. Steal 2 and 0 on the year a 1.42 ERA. Fourth best in the National League. There's Ruiz with a count of 0-2. And, and that hit him. You know, Kype, I'm starting to notice Ruiz. I don't think he minds sewing one on every now and then. Just kind of watching him roll with the pitches, roll with the punches, if you will. So Ruiz aboard. First pitch he goes. Throw to second base. Not in time. Stolen base for Ruiz. <laughs> Got a huge jump. He's five for five in steals this year. Hot recently. Last three games, he's six for 13. Ruiz over at third. Swing and a miss. Got him on the slider. And that's that. You hear that? It's Miller time. That's right. Mason Miller is here. And he has announced his presence with authority. Swing and a miss on a high fastball. 100 miles an hour. Right at the top of the zone. Good luck trying to hit that. So who was your first big league punch out? Uh, you remember the former MVP, Cody Bellinger? Yeah, Hunter, buy him. See how mom and dad like it. Oh, they love it. They love it. And that's another strikeout. So back-to-back -back strikeouts here in the top of the second. Oh, buckle up, Rios. Buckle up. I mean, you're just watching the reaction of these hitters right now, the way Patrick Wisdom kind of backed out of there, already calling timeout, trying to gather himself. Rios, he got locked up and jelly-legged. Swing and a miss, struck him out. He struck out the side. <laughs> Two swinging, one looking. Bottom of the third, Jordan Diaz to lead it off. There's the numbers from his 12 games in AAA. So Jordan Diaz brought to the big leagues today along with Mason Miller. Here's the one two broken by Flair behind second base out for is the shortstop Swanson and he's there to make the catch and there's one out. So one away for Connor Capel hitting in the ninth spot left center and that's going to get down for a hit. It's going to go all the way to the wall and Connor Capel with a one out double here in the third. Rudder takes off for third throw there tag. <laughs> he came off the base and Capel arguing with third base umpire Nick Marley. Mark is coming out. I think he's saying he's pushing me off the base. It kind of looked like he did, didn't it? I mean, Nick not only kept the tag on him, but he, he did it with a little bit of authority. But he came off the bag on his own. Two outs, 2-2. Two, two. In there, got him looking. Fourth strikeout for Justin Steele. Lead off walk to begin the fourth for Swanson and the Cubs. And right, now let's see if the Cubs can do some damage here in this fourth inning. Here's the 0-2. This one gets past the catcher Langoliers and cruising into second base is the runner Swanson on the wild pitch. Line drive, base hit out into right center field. 
Swanson around third. He's in to score. Another laser for Ian Happ. And it is 1-0. RBI double. Well, we got another guy that's not real concerned about velocity. So here's Cody Bellinger. Six for 11 in the series for Bellinger. Strike three called right on the inside corner, and Bellinger knew it. A hundred miles an hour dotting the inside corner. That may be a perfect pitch. 2 2 pitch. Did he go? Yes, he did. High fastball. And that strike got number five for Miller. Cubs get a run on Hap's RBI double. Oh, wow. Aledmis Diaz has been called out. Oh, boy. Here we go. So the pitch timer got Aledmis Diaz. Marcotze is really probably as animated well, as yeah. we've seen him. And Adam Hammery throws him out. And now Marcotze is going to get his, his piece here. So these get a runner in scoring position. We'll see if Carlos Perez can come through. Line fair. Down the right field line. It's going to tie up the ball game. Perez to second. A sliding double. Langelier scores. We got a 1 1 game. Now the Cubs have runners at the corners with no one out. It's lined to center field. Hosmer retreats to third. Ruiz picks it up. And Hosmer will come across to score. It's a sacrifice fly, and the Cubs have a 2 1 lead. So that's going to do it for Mason Miller in his major league debut. Four and a third innings this afternoon. And He'll get a nice ovation from the A's crowd. There's ball four to Wade, so the A's have a shot. And that'll bring up Jordan Diaz. He's 0 for 1. He popped his short. Line toward right. That's a hit. And it's scoot past Wisdom. Here comes Wade. He's got great speed. He's going to come around third, and he will score. And we're tied at two. The runners advance. Swanson now at third, Hap at second. On the ground, Aguilar coming home, and Swanson scrambles in. It's 3-2 as Bellinger able to make contact and place it in a good spot. So here's Patrick Wisdom with two on and one away. Wisdom hits it well, right field. Going back, Capel. Capel back some more. Hits over his head. And to score his hat. Bellinger racing for third. They're going to send him. And it ends up as a two-run triple for Patrick. Patrick Wisdom the other way. Kick and delivers. Check swing, gets by the catcher. Langoliers coming in to score. Wisdom, he slides in safely. Six to two Cubs now over the A's in the sixth. Hosmer, an infield single, one for three. In the air, pretty well struck. Left center field going back Ruiz, and that one is gone. Eric Hosmer, his first homer as a Cub. He'll circle the bases, the Cubs add on, and it's 7-2 as Haas goes deep. Bases loaded for the Cubs, here with one down at the top of the ninth. Drill towards right center field, that's going to split the gap, and it's going to bang up against the wall. Swanson is in, Happ is in, Bellinger will stop at third, now he's coming home, three score on the play, and it's 10-2. Madrigal hitting at 321 on the season. Line drive, and a base hit out into center field. In to score is Torrens. Behind him is Hosmer. Madrigal to second, and he's safe. And the Cubs have opened up a 12-2 lead. Swing and a miss, and he got him, and that's the ball game. The Cubs sweep the A's and win it here, 12-2. Guess we had no ads tonight in this video. So, they play tomorrow. Uh, I was told that there's rain in the forecast, so it might get postponed. So, who knows? I might see you tomorrow. If uh, not, hope to see you Friday in, in that case. It'll most likely be a doubleheader if tomorrow's game is postponed. So, peace out until the next video.